All right, moving on. I have no idea. I should probably have taken some time to prepare. Uh, uh, shit. What am I supposed to do with a Yeti? Eat Wandy Death, Yeti, or eat my face. What an abominable situation Graham has found himself in. All right, so I didn't do anything fast enough. All right, so this is going to be hard. All right, so uh, I just have to hope and pray. I'm going to save right here just to save myself some time. I uh, hope and pray I have exactly what I need in my inventory to dispatch a Yeti. So I have tambourines are for snakes. Uh, keys, no pie, no harp, no... <laughs> say it. The pouch is empty. The pouch is empty! Uh, a lump of beeswax, a hammer. All right. Let me think. What have I already used? I've already used the tambourine, because most of these things you just use once, and then, then after that, they're useless. Uh, the bees... I can't imagine how beeswax would do anything. The wand, no. Uh, I guess the hammer? Let's see what the hammer does. Please, Hammer, don't hurt him. That was ah. nothing to help Graham fight the powerful Yeti. All right, so Hammer, no. Can I talk it down? Excuse me. Can we talk? Oh, <laughs> uh, Mr. Yeti, uh, sir. Music soothes the savage beast. That will do nothing to help Graham fight. Nope. Not that savage what beast. abominable. All right. Uh, harp. Uh, maybe I'll try using the harp on myself. <sighs> Having learned to play the harp long ago, Graham hey. now plays beautifully. Yes. Uh, 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 no, 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 no. What an abominable situation Graham has found himself in. All right, come on. If it got my hopes up by playing the harp music. God damn it. All right, Yeti. So I'll just have to, I'm just going to try everything. All right, so I cannot. What? I, amulet? No, I guess. No. What? What? Are you fucking kidding me? Did I just defeat a Yeti with a pie? A pie. Uh, uh, I give up. This game. This game. A pie to defeat a Yeti. Uh, can I? No. All right. All right. I'm just going to forget that ever happened. And... Ooh. One especially beautiful crystal right, catches I... Graham's notice in the center of the crystal cave. All right, so apparently he just wants one specific crystal. As strong as he is, even Graham can't break the stubborn crystal with All his right, bare hands. So, um, I guess that's what the hammer is for. All right. So very gently. Graham hits the beautiful crystal several times with his hammer. I noticed you weren't doing it too gently before. He's like, dark, 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 crystal, 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 crystal. Among his other possessions. Um. All right, I don't see too much else interesting in here. Brilliant crystals flashing and sparkling and reflecting off the numerous waterfalls cause Graham to gaze in awe and wonderment <laughs> at the dazzling spectacle before like, him. Page two. Um. All right, uh, uh, mission accomplished, I, I guess. So let me save just in case I do something stupid and I don't have to throw the pie at the Yeti again because that'll make me angry. God, I just wanted you to walk to the right, Graham. I did. Oh, oh, that last step. Anger rising. All right, so let's. Uh, is there any way to mute this guy's voice? Just for the... just. F I can't turn on text. So I turn the volume down so I don't have to hear him. Then I can't hear what he's... I don't... Oh, God damn it. All right. I see that the Yeti is dead. <laughs> when nice Bella will be pleased. Come, follow me. <laughs> oh. Bad voice Warning. acting. This really. cartoon contains... Just show me the fucking cartoon. 
I don't think I'm going to learn anything too interesting just by watching these two mosey on over this precarious ledge. But... Ah, good. You have returned in victory, I It sounded like she said, awkward. Yes, the Yeti is dead. He will no longer be a scourge upon your realm. I'm too embarrassed to tell to you how I vanquished yes. him. I but you'll notice I am one pie less... I want to thank you for ridding my mountain domain of the horrible Yeti. Please rise, King Graham. Yes, I know who you are, and I have been informed of your quest. Please call I me do Swayze. Luck against the wizard Morda. Why am I always you the last to go. know? We wish you well on your difficult journey. Sir Grey Wolf will show I'm glad you the to see they've gotten the past mountain. the kidnapping incident. Oh, damn it. I wanted to see what would happen if I didn't play the harp. Um. All right, just. Uh, fine, just walk, 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 walk. Come on, I want to, I want to die. I want to see myself get ripped apart by wolves. All right, so let's save here, and let me see. Did I restore? Damn it, I'm a retard, and I overwrote this where I wanted to be. Ah, <sighs> crap. I guess the world will never know. Um. So that's, I guess I could, do I get down this way? Yes, okay. All right, onwards and upwards. Looks like I crawl up this little hole here. I hope he does have to do it automatically because I don't know what to push. All right. What? I was just about to grab some nectar of the gods. Don't, don't drop shit on me now. Oh, oh. Okay. I've a nice little village down here. I wonder if I get to visit this place later. See, I'll notice I'm looking at a village and I just got kidnapped by a fucking two-headed bird. I'm like, ooh, look at the scenery. Graham um, can see a glittering gold locket lying among the leaves and sticks of the rock's nest. Graham rescues a I'll lovely golden it. locket from the leafy clutches of the rock's nest. Alright, how do I... How do I... Um, oh, uh, oh, nice oh dear. Birdie. Good birdie. I need to. <laughs> uh, I am so goo. fucked. Gucci, Gucci, goop. No. Hey. Hang on. I'll get you out of this. I'm saved, but I lost my cloak. The damn birds. Hey. Like Robinson Crusoe, this place is primitive as can be. Oh, Grim, where have you Grim. been? I've been looking all over for you. Ooh. You'd never believe it, Cedric. You'd never believe it. Thank you, so please spare me your exposition. Ooh. All right, so let's grab this, uh, whatever it is. Uh, all right, come on. The one time I need the narrator to tell me what something is, and he clams up. Come on. The heavy iron bar is a bit rusted from being out in the weather. All right, so it's just a, an iron bar. I just noticed... How far did that eagle just take me? Because I went from a very icy, high mountaintops, Everest style, down to a tropical, subtropical beach. This, this part of the world has everything. We've gone from the temperate zone of the town to hot, arid deserts, to cold mountaintops, to pleasant beaches. It's either lazy game design or just some really weird, uh, some weird weather phenomenons happening here. Delicate chain. All right, so I have a new locket. brilliant crystal shard feels smooth in Graham's hands. Sounds very Final Fantasy-ish, brilliant crystal shard. All right, so let's save, and we shall continue moseying. And I'm still just praying to God. I still ha I need, I have everything I need from the town. Is it a poisonous boat? Yeah, I would not bend over around these girls. Goodbye, Cedric. See you later, sucker. Gucci, Gucci, goo.